Hello party people, I'm at Ikea today. Of course we're gonna shop around. There are a few things that I have my eye on, uh, but typically when I come here for a certain thing, I end up getting other things. But I have to share with you, when I was driving up, the person in front of me was in a U-Haul truck. They are doing some serious shopping today, okay? We're not that serious. But I do love to look around this store and I haven't been here in a while and they have baby stuff. What? Let's go. The IKEA food always makes me drool and it's so inexpensive. The veggie balls are one of my favorite things to eat. This gooey cake, a dollar, are you kidding? I think that's new, I haven't seen it before. Take a look at how gorgeous this first room is. I love their displays. That blue chair in the back, and there's a vanity back there. What a dream. At first I thought, oh my gosh, do, does Ikea sell makeup brushes? But I don't think so. Still gorgeous, still want it all. Look at those shoes, whoever lives here is fancy. Another little house over here. Oh my gosh, no one's in it. What? They're doing construction, so there's that. <laughs> so beautiful. Can someone decorate my living room like this? That kitchen is gorgeous too. I love the gray tones. Oh, there's even a desk back there. Do you see it? Ikea fits so many things in such a small space. Look, a double oven. Oh, this kitchen is a dream. That white sofa is only $400, and this blue and white striped one, so gorgeous. Love the foot, foot things. I don't know what they're called, but it's on sale. The lighting in here is ridiculous, but don't let me forget to get one of these. I've been meaning to get one for like, oh, I don't know, a year. But look at this desk lamp. Oh my word, it's only $28. I know you can't really see it, it's so dark, but it's perfect for $27. Another beautiful little living room over here. And again, little desk area. Love that mirror on the wall. Are you guys getting any like decor inspiration or furniture inspiration? I mean, I am, but my problem is I get so overwhelmed. Wait, create your dream room for only $1,100. What? What? I like those drapes. I feel like I have definitely shown you guys this room before last time I was here, but take a peek at this hilarious reading lamp. Look how small the little light is, but it's perfect. Ooh, it's $25. It's just as much as... <gasps> Maybe that's perfect for my desk. Minimal amount of space, you know what I mean? Ooh, and it's cheaper. Another little living room right here. Love the color scheme of like the mint green with the pink mauve -y and the wood tones, oh my gosh. Look, even the little details, the bicycle on the wall, the wine in the box, cacti. I don't know about this lamp, but that's okay. <laughs> Kinda looks like a flower, actually, it's pretty cool. Yes, I love these. Okay, so they put together a home that's 592 square feet living room, and it's actually pretty spacious, and they fit so much into it. It's nicer than my home, really, to be quite honest. <laughs> Dining room and kitchen all together. I love how they use the wall space, all, the, all of that vertical space right there. I've been watching too much HGTV. Okay, over here is the bedroom with the, oh, what are those called, wardrobes. Again, all the way to the ceiling, and then this desk area. Oh, look at that desk lamp. That's pretty snazz. Even more storage space over here. This full length mirror. How much is that? Is that only $50? $50 for this enormous mirror. Wow, that's beautiful. Okay, through the little hallway over here. I think that's a cleaning storage closet. Bathroom. Hey, what's up? And yes, they even have a kid's bedroom slash guest bedroom slash whatever you want it to be. Oh my gosh, and a reading nook. I don't have a reading nook in my house. A tub, toilet, okay. Let's get out of here. I had to peek in the storage closet because I'm nosy like that. Wait, these little storage boxes are $3? Look how big that is. Wow, okay, I'm gonna have to find those. They have all of their summer storage right here. Even a boogie board. I wanna be with these people. 
And of course, every bit of wall space is used up. They use the walls to hang extra seating. All right, let's get out of here. I love this little entryway too, with a mirror on the wall. Oh my gosh, what is this little storage hanging thing? Okay, this is the storage, the wooden hanging shelf right here, $81. It's a three-tier shelf. Ooh, I like that. Oh my gosh, they even live with a dog. <sighs> These people are the coolest. Another spacious living room. Oh, they're missing a little photograph right there. <laughs> I don't know where that went. Uh, maybe it fell, whoops. Over here, what is this? Oh, this is the dining room. What is this on the wall? Is that like some kind of storage area? Let me see here. How do we open this up? Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, this is cool. Uh, look at that. Look at that. This is awesome. But it's a thousand dollars, so maybe wait for a sale. Dining room, living room inspiration again. Love that gold lamp in the background. I don't even really need a lamp. I mean, I kind of do for my desk, but I'm really drawn to them. This blue color on the clock with the gold detailing. Oh my gosh, take me away, Ikea. Oh look, they're playing Scrabble. Can I join in? I love this space for so many reasons. I really like those drapes, how they hang them like one in the middle. I don't, should I be doing that? I don't know. Okay, over here, let me explain to you why I love it so much. Oh, these garbage cans, these stackable garbage cans. <gasps> $10, I've been looking for like one to oh construction paper i want one for recyclables because our recyclable is like outside and it's always a pain anyway candy land that's my kind of party i'm loving all the artwork like who did these kids of ikea workers i hope so another little space right here oh my gosh i didn't even notice that lamp before when i was browsing over it but there are so many things i love about this room as well first of all the matching drapes to the cups on the table. Talk about attention to detail, but this is what caught my eye. $15, um, I think it goes to here. What? On Amazon, those are so expensive. And by so expensive, I mean $18? I don't know, I don't remember. I just know I never bought one. Also the flowers on the table. And then this wine rack over here. I don't even drink wine. That looks cool. There's that clock again. And I also really like this shelf. And I'm not sure how much the baskets are, but that basket is really cute. And I'm also drawn, oh, I like these amber jars. And that plate, $3, what? I found this, it's really cool. It's a three USB port, uh, but it's $8. I feel like I just went to Costco and I saw a huge like two pack for 15. So I'm gonna pass on that, but it's that's very cool. Spotted this little guy, it's pretty cool too. It's $5, but are you the type of person that this would drive you crazy where it doesn't close completely? What would you put in there? Chocolate? <laughs> oh my gosh, that TV is on. Wow, that's new. Hey, I thought I would just scan over the furniture for you. Little TV stands again. Oh look, another reading light. That one is $60 though. This is a new item. This uh, tall shelf is $165. And this one over here is $300. Oh my, I have a space for both, okay? This brown shelf is available too if you're on a budget. 20 bucks. I'm really drawn to something like this with the glass, uh, but then the downside of this is like everyone can see inside. I mean, same as with an open shelf. So this one is $200, this one is $350, and this smaller one is $169, but I think it's metal, and these are wood. Oh my word, these are super pretty too. They are, ooh, they're six dollars, but pretty. Another little space here. And can I just say, I am so enjoying seeing some parents around here shopping with their kids for college. So fun. How about this chair? It looks nice and comfortable. Oh wait, <laughs> I don't know how much it is. I do need a new computer chair. I like that one. Also these bins, I initially came here for these. They come in a bunch of different colors but I need them like a half inch smaller or an inch smaller, whatever they are. I'm so bummed because they're only like four bucks. These floating shelves are a great deal too. Uh, $20 for the, ooh, wait, which one? Wait, this huge one is 
Oh my gosh. Wait, no, 30. Okay, this one is 20. This one is 30. These are eight. And you can get buy a whole thing for uh, 60. So many computer chairs to choose from and they're all reasonably priced. If you compare them to prices from Target or even Amazon, you'll be so surprised. Because I left, I ended up buying the kids chairs for, well, my kids, that were like 50 bucks and I thought, oh, too expensive. But everywhere else wanted a similar quality. I think it was these for much more money. So wait, is it now on sale for $15? I'm gonna die. No, it's just the seat for 15 and then this, but you can buy it all. I guess it's on sale right now for $40. But I do like that they sell just the seat because if it gets grody and nasty over time, I don't have to buy a whole new chair. I can just buy a new seat. And that reminds me of Austin Powers. <laughs> the ultimate industrial style. Love this. Look at this table. And I guess all of the tables, not tables, sorry, desks are 20% off until, oh, real soon. Sorry guys. <laughs> disregard the sale currently browsing some lamps but take a look at this snazzy lamp look how slim that is it's 18 dollars or 17 it's 18 bucks i'm a simple gal i see a, a yellow sign that says 14.99 and i'm drawn to it okay the drawer unit bitch one. Oh, you know what i have one of these there it is 15 bucks for that well worth the money we are now entering arguably my favorite section, the kitchens. I always get so tempted to like redo my kitchen. I'm like, yes, can I redo everything in my house? Please, Ikea. Like, look at this. This measuring cup is so cute. Five bucks. Oh my gosh, I almost broke it. I'm so excited. Five dollars, the lighting in here is terrible. This is cool. Also, not really sure what this is, but I do need a bench scraper. I don't know what that is. Pastry knife? Like what? Okay, just leave it. What caught my eye is this sink faucet, and then I like those right there, those curtains, whatever they are. Pretty. Oh, the faucet alone is 120. But look how cool that is. That has a cool factor for sure. I'm kind of obsessed with the chalkboard as a cabinet or a wall or something. Wait, what is this and what is it doing in my kitchen? <gasps> a paint set? Wait, 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 how do I get in here? Oh gosh, I think you need brains to get in here. I don't have that. Okay, I'm giving up um, <laughs> over here. I wanted to show you this chalkboard. I mean, I know I could just paint. I almost painted my pantry door in my last house, but then I thought, oh, my handwriting is so bad. <laughs> so I just talked myself out of it. What's this little bowl right here? Six dollars. <gasps> Guys, is anyone else obsessed? They have a smaller two cup one. Oh my goodness. Is anyone else obsessed with kitchen? supplies like what is that right there i don't know but it looks cool and i want it it's a watering can of course it is ikea of course it is plants in your kitchen that's a lot of plants for your kitchen how about this one over here it looks like if i had to guess they just came home from yoga uh or the beach not really sure one or the other love this little pantry section back here too <gasps> wait do they sell pepper grinders here? Display only. That tells me no, they do not. Ooh, but this they do. Ooh, $20 though. It's out of my budget. Oh my gosh, look at these bowls. Those are so cute. Oh my gosh, $5 for, I don't even know what that is. Okay, a spice shaker. Look at this. Okay, what is this, first of all, slash how much is it? Oh Lord, $60, but look how stinking cute it is. You can just cart all your things around your kitchen. Oh, they sell extra rubber rings. Nice, I like that. If only my pantry looked this organized and cool all the time. Look at that rat, it's Ratatouille. What you doing in here? I hear a lot of great things about this high chair. I literally had to look at the tag like to, to see what it was called because all I wanted to call it was a kid feeder. <laughs> I'm the worst. How are you, my friend? 
Okay, anyway, I hear everyone rave about it. Easy to clean, it's cheap, it's like 22 bucks or something. Look at this pantry, what a dream. Oh my gosh, it's even a mud closet. Mud, mud, mud room? Guys, I don't know, I live in Florida. We don't have mud rooms or basements. <laughs> Oh, oh, look how big that storage container is for $15. Okay, what else is interesting over here? Pretty much, what's this? Is this like to infuse your water or tea? Probably for tea. Ooh, I like these magnets. Wonder where I can find some. <laughs> oh, dog biscuits. Okay, oh my gosh, a salad bowl. 20 bucks, does it come with little bowls? I'm so frugal. I'm like, if it costs more than what I'm putting in it, <laughs> it's not worth it. These are huge too. I know we're not at the storage section yet, but, and this one is glass. They don't have prices on them, but I'll be sure to take a peek. Oh my gosh, I feel like I need that one. Okay, let's go, let's go. Oh look, this shoe holder too. Did you guys know about these? I have one, well, it's, uh, these are the less expensive ones, they're plastic. But they work just as well, same kind of thing. Also, did you know they sold things like this? $3 for this water bottle, I feel like it's a little jiffy because it's plastic. This uh, little container set, I'm not exactly sure how many pieces are in here. Oh, that many, and it's $4. And then also this cooler, little lunchbox slash cooler for three bucks. This is my dream laundry room because there's no laundry in it. <laughs> okay, over here, beautiful kitchen. So I saw this beautiful kitchen with the unfinished door. Is that a thing or are they not finished with it yet? Still doing renos? Uh, but this tray caught my eye, it's only $13. I feel like that's really good. And oh, these spoons are nice. Another gorgeous kitchen. I don't know if you can see, I'll step over there in a minute, but they have these cups and bowls that are blue and white. Oh my gosh, they even have a back room. Is that an entry room? And this little comfy station over here. Oh look, another baby feeder. <laughs> baby, whatever it is, you guys know. <gasps> Wait, I see like Carnivale masks. Are those toys that they sell? Those are so fun. That artwork is cute too. Again, with the chalkboard on the wall, makes it so fun, right? Okay, so here are the blue and white plates. So pretty. I don't know how much they are. These are the bowls and they're four dollars and these cups over here don't have a price either But look at this. This tray is gorgeous. Oh my gosh Look at this little command station too. Fifteen dollars. Oh, they have swimming lessons today. That's where they are I was wondering so here I am obsessing over the pantry and the organizational things. Oh look at that I'm obsessed. I want one. How much is it? I want it. I like it. I need it, I buy it, I don't know the words. Okay, $3 for this, but the lid doesn't uh, secure and close all the way. And then I thought, oh, $5 for these, these are fun. And then saw lemons, $5 for a nine pack of lemons. How funny is that? I wonder if they sell the other fruit too. Limes, apples. Look at this fancy garlic press for four bucks. And then what is that, for eggs I think? three dollars for an egg slicer seasoning oh my goodness i don't even know how to use these anymore just kidding just kidding i do but i heard that millennials don't know how to use them use finger quotes because technically i'm a millennial but i don't feel like one these are cool too hmm three dollars there's a lot in there so many cool sections. First of all, that garbage bag holder or grocery bag holder is three bucks. These sponges right here, two dollars for all of them. Look how fun they look. I mean, they don't feel like the best quality, but for two bucks. Also, these kitchen towels, I bought some a while ago and they're still kicking. I think there's four in here for four dollars and I actually love them so much. I might buy more. I mean, I don't need more. What is this? Is this like a fire starter? Oh my gosh. Oh, I just used my brain and read some words and I think it's a tool, so <laughs> not my area of expertise, but really what is, you know what I mean? Okay, let's move along. I'm in the market for a new like oil pourer. Guys, names for things just 
they escape me okay i don't even know if there is a name for it but this is for oil and vinegar like for your salads kind of want to buy it ten dollars also this basket is absolutely gorgeous it comes in a few different colors i have seen it in white oh yep right there so red white and blue hey oh my gosh ikea loves america <laughs> thirteen dollars look what i found i didn't even really know that this existed it's a drawer mat so i guess your stuff doesn't like shift around pretty cool oh my goodness because our silverware shifts around a lot so i think i'm going to try that out and then look at that hardware $30 they sell a drill wait painting supplies a level cool beans I keep walking away from my purse it's gonna get stolen someone's gonna steal it I'm not even really sure what section we're in right now maybe outdoor but look at this little get up they have over here look I swear they do love America 4th of July but what is this a lingonberry drink concentrate elderflower what is that for real i know it's not juice it can't is it juice i mean it's probably juice but what caught my eye is this little decor set up over here i'm in awe can someone please help me like decorate <laughs> i figured it out i'm in the dining room table section table and chairs uh there are many many to choose from Let's take a peek behind me as well how what oh my gosh what's i'm eyeballing all of the cake pie right there oh, the restaurant closes at three today so i don't think i'm gonna make it shut up right now and look at this closet slash bathroom back there peeking in but what caught my attention is that i don't own any shoes that need to be protected by a case <laughs> that is amazing Oh my gosh. It's like a boutique in your house. It is a boutique in your house. Look, they even have like, what is that? Sparkling cider. Even unmentionables just right here in Ikea. Okay, gotta move, okay. This is the nicest bathroom I've ever been into. Oh my gosh, I love it. The woman who lives here is so fancy. She even has a record player. Do you guys have a record player? That's legit right there some bedroom inspiration for you love that floor length mirror and the floating shelves everything looks so clean i'm pretty much obsessing over this room right here for quite a few reasons first reason that wall decor love it what are those tiles plant stands they're canvases also these boxes where are they i want five this matching bed set do you think alex will go for it Another mock house for 270 square feet. Here is the kitchen, and I've actually been watching the HGTV show, something about like tiny houses, and I'm kind of obsessed about them, or with them. Oh, cheese grater, how much are you? Four dollars! I told you I got gypped at Target. I should just buy this here. Box cheese grater, okay. Ooh, they changed a course since last time, I like it. Okay, so a little office area over here, right off the kitchen. The kitchen's right there. Not exactly sure where the entryway is. I think right there. Uh, living room. Nice. Slash bedroom, I guess. Futon. <laughs> they even have guitars hanging up. People who live here are very musical. Look at that fedora. I love all of those pegs up there. So much storage. And the storage way, way up. Oh my gosh, forget about it. Oh, and they have a dog too, they must. Unless that's for a small child, I don't know. I don't know the people who live here, I'm just intruding upon their home. That locker, cool. All right, and then the bathroom over here, shower. Storage literally to the ceiling. I am just so amazed. How do they reach up there? What kind of shelf do they use? Where do they keep their ladder? So many questions. I love that artwork on the wall too. It's $13, what? Are you kidding me? And then over here is obviously the rest of the bathroom. Ooh, look at that bathroom vanity. $159, are you kidding me? $149 for the sink. Oh my God, someone, I'm, I'm gonna keel over. Someone come call the paramedics. Another room, this room is basically the size of that entire house over there. Pretty in pink, very nice. Okay, I also wanna take a long look at the bathrooms over here. Double sink vanity, 
these oh my gosh I saw all of this online okay and this is like oh it's a thousand dollars I want to say online I saw some maybe it was just one sink for like 600 some of them 300 I, but I like this little uh, I don't know what you want to call it but I like it and then over here just peek inside their closet right there just a little look into their lives so they have boogie boards too Dude, they're all going boogie boarding. Prime example of how Ikea shoves everything into nothing. $100 for this. This lifts up, sewing kit, whatever you want to put in there. Oh, I saw nail polish. And then a drawer. Like what, could you even imagine that all of that storage space would fit in this awesome desk for a hundred dollars Ooh, pretty but they're 10 bucks is it worth ten dollars is my question okay that is really cool it's made out of cardboard so don't get it wet oh gosh can't close it okay got it all right and then this right here 140 dollars what can you put in there endless possibilities is it a drawer sure is dresser dresser over there okay Ooh, these look really pretty too Looks like that fancy woman's house over there. Oh my gosh, so many little compartments. Reminds me of a caboodle. Okay, so I guess these are some new items. The colors definitely look new to me. I haven't seen those uh, deep, rich colors before. I found the boxes. You get two of them, two boxes for $10. I can, like the storage possibilities are endless in here. Am I right? Am I wrong? Will I use them? Probably not. I wasn't gonna share this, uh, I don't know, kids room with you, but then I found a gem, a smaller version of this light fixture. It's amazing, is it smaller or is it just farther away? Optical illusion, I don't know. This room is pretty dark, but I had to share with you these shelves over here. Another screaming deal. They come in two sizes. So the smaller size is $10 and the larger size is 20. I just love that it has a lip on the shelf and it's kind of floating, but kind of has a back. Oh my gosh, this guy has shelves all over the place. These hooks are always adorable. How much are they? I look at them every time, $6. I'm like, where am I gonna hang on them? Where am I even gonna put them? I don't know, they have overalls hanging. So I guess that goes to say that you could literally hang whatever you want on them. Look at this nice rug. It's kind of expensive. I forgot the price, but I saw it somewhere else and thought, ooh, Oh my gosh, this beautiful mirror too. Hey there, uh, $100. What, and then this vanity? I wanna live in this girl's room, whoever she is. I wanna be her, I wanna raise her. I just, I gotta leave, cause I'm not her. Closet organization eludes me, seriously overwhelms me so much. I don't even know where to start. Now we're gonna enter the kids zone. First of all, I love all of their storage systems. I forgot the name, Trofast. That's the name of all of them. And then there's different styles and stuff. So those shelves over there, they kind of look like the spice rack shelves, but they're the kids version, which is larger. I have some for Wentworth's room and I love them. And this desk looks new to me. At least the bench does. I don't know, maybe it's because we have the old version. Also love the bunk bed slash underneath is all of that living area, living space with the desk. Oh, this is the same one right there. Same bad lighting too. <laughs> Look at this pillow. There's literally one left. I have nowhere to put it. It's not gonna match anything in my house, but I want it. Buy it, it'll match those boxes. <laughs> I'm walking away, but I seriously want it so bad. There's one left. What if that's the last one ever? <laughs> it's not. Okay, this might be seriously the longest Ikea shop with me ever because we still have all of downstairs. The good news is my energy level usually puts out once I reach downstairs, unless I stop to eat first. That might happen. Look at all of these rugs. Ooh, this one is new. <gasps> the blue and white. That's a thing, isn't it? $40, it's gorgeous. Really, we've had we've had many Ikea rugs. Look at that, this, that one is $10. Oh, amazing, and it's huge, love it. Also, all of these arts and crafts. I love all of their options, but to be honest, I feel like some things might be cheaper at the Dollar Tree. So like colored pencils, even though these are really nice colored pencils, I've had, oh, they're water, actually, they're like water colors and we've had them before we love them so they're worth it what else oh the construction paper is i think five dollars you do get a lot but a lot of it is white so i also feel like 
I don't know, back to school is coming soon, you know? Also have to share with you the little kids play area. <laughs> Love this. They have so much to play with over here. And of course, everything they have for sale as well. It's perfect little way to get your kids to beg you for something. <laughs> and they have books. Right now they're 40% off. The good selection. And then over here, this train set, we have had it before. We actually really love it. I ended up donating it, but it's 10 bucks. It's an amazing deal. Look, you can get a whole town with it. Expansion sets. Now entering the baby section over here. Is that a bobby pillow? It's very similar, but it is $25. You guys know we found one for like 15 at Burlington Coat Factory. Hashtag, it's only called Burlington now, but it will always be Burlington Coat Factory for me. Look at that changing table. How much is that? It's less than a hundred bucks. I think what I really like is just the lighting over here. So the changing table is $70. Oh, what? Say what? Is that a garbage can, a diaper, diaper pail? Oh my gosh, hold on, let me explore first. This crib, everything is so, inexpensive $129 for a crib they also have mattresses and sheets uh, literally like I think you can make a baby registry look at that toilet that's the one we have I recommend it to everyone it's like four or five dollars and it's amazing easy to clean it is a little garbage pail and it's ten dollars look how stinking cute that is I don't know what that is nat natting oh it's a basket Oh my gosh, look at those baskets. Okay, I'm getting loud. People are gonna start to complain. $8, oh my, I don't need them. I want them because they're on sale. Look at this with the mouse, what is this? It's a cover, some kind of cover, burp cloth. They sell burp cloths, look how cute those are for $5. I don't need them. They're so cute. Oh my, God. oh my gosh, the blue and white. I need to get out of here, but I have no self-control, okay. What is this beautiful blanket? Where did it come from? Down here. I don't know if I can put this down. It's so pretty. I found where they go. They're $13, which I think is a really great price for a baby blanket. <gasps> I wanna buy it. I wanna buy it, but I don't need another dang blanket. Okay, sippy cups. The most hilarious sippy cups ever. <laughs> Take a peek at this cool feature. The garbage can clips on or not clips on, what does it clip on? Heck yeah, it does. You can even screw it in to this changing table and even this over there. Oh, so cool, Ikea. They also have, wait, what is $2? A soft toy, a ball. Oh, okay. Um, but this little wooden PlayStation, that's really cute. And then this over here, I think it's for bigger kids. Someone probably just left it over here. Here are the baby feeders. Wait, so they have two sizes. Okay, one is without a tray for 18, and one is with the tray for 23. But is it just the tray for 23? Now I'm confused. I don't think so. And then you can even buy a little cover for it, easy to clean for $8. It's not just a cover, it's like a, well, it's got a little bit of fluff in there. Maybe they blew it up. It feels like, feels like an inflatable. They even have like burp cloths, and what else is over here? Wait, what is this? I don't even know. Is that for the bath? Like a toy for the bath? Yeah, we're just gonna move along. I'm gonna assume it's a bath toy because there's some more. Oh, and look, there's the potty. I think they raised the price. Oh Lord, it's $7 now. Uh, the white one with more thingamajigs. This is just, it's just too much to clean, okay? Just get the green one, it's perfect and it's a dollar less, so I don't know. They even have bath towels, $12, $10, ooh, $8 for that one, cute. And then uh, they have changed their little kids dining supplies over here, 250 for a six pack. And if you can see, the colors are completely different. Like it's the same kind of material and bowl, but the colors, they're opaque and they kind of look I don't, like 80s, 70s style to me. Still gonna buy them because they're cheap. <laughs> I just assumed that you guys would know this, but just in case you don't, they also have plates, of course, and then silverware back there. Cups, yes, it's an all amazing. Just gonna scan over the little toy section really quickly. We have all of those, love them all. I think at one point we had like all the Ikea toys, no regrets. I don't even know, don't ask questions, just that's that. 
And even more toys up here. Stop it, I might have to get this. It's $15, look how fun that is. Oh my gosh, that's really cute. Okay, moving along, that has a, a top to it. There we go. And then all of these. Look at that abacus, 10 bucks, so cool. We have now entered the downstairs portion. Uh, it's mostly kitchen stuff, cookware, outdoor, uh, probably more, I don't remember. I usually zoom zoom past it. Oh look, the grater. Okay, tough decisions. Metal grater, $4. Metal grater with wood, with meh, I, why, that, that one's seven. I can't even speak. Guys, I don't know. I'm probably not gonna get either one. Popsicle holders though. Salad spinner for six, a microwave top for $1.29. They have all of these beautiful, I kind of want that white one, those strainers. Everything looks so pretty when it's hung up, right? You know, when it's organized correctly. Look at these measuring cups, $6. The little teaspoons and stuff are five. A little pricey. What is that, an egg beater? This is like old school, handheld. I love that. Okay, they have literally all kinds of strainers over here. Ooh, more colors, red, white, and blue. Hey, yes, I have one of these. This is a potato press, but I have one, well, it's like, really old school if you saw my like thanksgiving cook with me i used it a spatula maker look at this grater over here five dollars for this and it holds it all for you i think it comes with different lids too it does uh again i'm gonna pass flour sifter okay I'm, let's just move last time i saw this and i really regretted not getting it i can't even that's glued down are you kidding me okay it's like an eight by eight dish and it's three dollars and it's glass and feels really quality. Definitely grab one this time. I'm definitely going to grab one this time and they have more sizes. Seven dollars for the larger. Oh my God, they just have so many. <gasps> Here are the measuring cups. Oh, look at these mini bunt cake pans. Okay, okay. There's a lot to look at. And of course, oh, look at these bowls. Of course I want it all. Look at that spring foam pan. Spring form, I don't care. These are really pretty. Is it a one? Okay, this is $7. Oh, this feels so nice. $10, hmm, okay, should I? Oh my gosh, okay, never mind. I was gonna ask if I should go with the white. It's 30. Let's back up here, okay, let's back up. Here is a better view of what they have to offer. Oh, this one for $10. Again, I can't lift it up. Lord goodness. Uh, so hopefully you can like scan the prices if you're interested. And they get smaller from there. Okay, now decisions to make. They also, of course, nothing surprises me anymore, sell knives. That three-piece set is $15. This little paring knife is $1.50. I'm gonna buy it. I feel like ours are always dirty when I go to wash it and of course, I had to share with you this knife sharpener. Someone just sent me one and I was like laughing so hard because I had no idea what it was. Obviously, if you guys watch my cook with me, my knives are so dull and I complain. And I'm like, ah, I need to buy new ones. People are like, just sharpen them. Well, they have one here at Ikea for $5. Not sure how much they are on Amazon. Mine was a gift and I used it love it it's amazing just trying to share the deals with you guys two pack of cutting boards these like plastic cutting boards two bucks they also have all of those knives over there i'm gonna be here for a while okay all of these cutting boards they have to offer really great quality and um i have a couple actually maybe just one from ikea but they have the wood oil i used olive oil <laughs> because I thought that was okay, but maybe this is better. I don't know, maybe I used mineral oil. I can't remember. I Googled it. Stop it right now. Okay, I've been browsing without you guys. Sorry. Hamburger press. Are you kidding me? It's $8, but like, that is so cool. This is apparently new, $2.99. Oh, little baby tongs. And I am looking for my bench scraper. Hope they have one. I was kind of upset because I didn't understand at first, but these are sold separately. It's a dollar, and then you have to spend a dollar on the top, which I guess is fine. Still, two dollars is not that expensive, but they also have these wooden tops. What? So cool, right? That is so pretty. Also, these containers are giving me 70s vibes, and I love it. In case you're in the market, they have pots and pans, and a lot of them 
and I don't know what a good price is. I have an induction stove, so I feel like my pots are expensive, which is why I need new ones and refuse to buy them. <laughs> Pot holders, oh, those are pretty pots, the blue ones. They have a little collection of them over here. Aren't they cute? This is something that they've had for as long as I've been coming to Ikea. Scream and deal, $6. $6 for this huge set of uh, storage Tupperware. Now that I'm in the storage section, I'm like, how big do I need it? Um, I don't, how many do I need? <laughs> I don't even know what I'm trying to store, okay? I'm just nesting. I feel like I like this size. It's $4 and then the lid is two, so a little bit more expensive, but obviously much bigger. Oh, they have all kinds of sizes. Cute. They also offer these kinds of containers from what I see, like, um, four dollars. I think that one's two or three and then six. I want to know. Oh, the dish drainer is three. How much are those plates? Oh, a dish brush for 50 cents. What? I don't need one, but for 50 cents, where are you? Down here? And then these nice sponges. These are two dollars. Take a look at these. Have you ever used them? They're four dollars. I guess you just cover anything you want with them and it keeps it fresh. <laughs> I don't know. You tell me if you've ever used it. Oh, look at this too. It looks like a camping set. I mean, you can use it for whatever, but... Oh, look, a little compact lunchbox. That's pretty sweet. Again, different sizes of storage containers. That one's $3 over there. This one... Oh, oh, the top is three. Haha, <laughs> fooled me. I don't know how much the bottom is. I'm tempted to buy one of these for spaghetti. It's $5. I don't know where I would put it. Obviously in my pantry, but like, do I need it? Look at these beauties. That cake stand, whatever that is, it's so pretty. Then they have bowls. Oh wait, what's $2.49? <gasps> Ooh, a serving bowl. It's glass? What? It looks like the Olive Garden salad bowls. Ooh, look at this one. That one's really nice. Ooh, really nice stuff over here. Okay, $8. All right. Oh, these bowls too. I think we saw these somewhere else. Oh, they're $29. Oh, look at this little basket. Cute. Oh, that little bowl is $15. And then the salad bowls again. Or wooden bowls, whatever. Metal right there. Those cookies are tempting me, okay? Right in the middle of the store, really. I just have to take a moment to appreciate the fact that One Direction is playing. I love One Direction. This pillow feels really nice. It's on sale. Mmm, new stuff right there. Not exactly sure what is new or if it's all new. <gasps> Look at these. These are really pretty. I don't know how much they are, but they're very huge. Okay, maybe it's all new. I'm not exactly sure, but these white lanterns are pretty and so are those pillows. I'm now in the bathroom section touring the vanities. Not really finding anything I'm like falling in love with. Except, for, wait, what is this? I don't even know what that is. You guys tell me, what is that? Does it belong here? Ooh, look at that pretty hook. Anyway, this is what I wanted to show you. Look how pretty this little storage unit is. Three, uh, you get three little things there for six bucks. This one, two, four dollars. And it's not like perfectly sealed, but like good enough, you know what I mean? If, you're, if it's, I'm looking more toward for arts and crafts. This little bathroom is my favorite so far. I, I just love everything about it. The mirror, the vanity, the Hemnes stuff. I have like four of those pieces in my home. And then look at that shelf right there. Way cuter than a medicine cabinet, right? Not to mention this. Oh my gosh, the candle, but the candle stand or holder, whatever that is, so pretty. I just love everything about it. But um, these, I was looking at them and I know this is for a bathroom, but I'm thinking uh, I can use it outside as a plant stand, right? It's cute. Will it last outside? I don't know. Will I have to stain it? Because I won't do that. <laughs> Even this is cute. Alex likes to have a lot of storage. So what I'm looking at here mostly is the over the toilet storage. Pretty. I'm looking for curtains for my bedroom and I want something nice and light. And though all of these might look the same, I found Matilda that I really enjoy. And then this one's really pretty too. And they're both inexpensive, $15 for two panels. But I can't find them. Wish me luck. In my dreams. Ooh, Taylor Swift is playing. You guys know I need a rug. It's a good time to shop. I see how this is gonna go. Okay, these are new rugs. That one over there, $150. And I really like these. Uh, this is my favorite, also new, $250. But 
I don't know if the color is too light and it's just gonna get dirty. I don't know. I have such a hard time making decisions. There are a ton more over here and I really like this polka dot one. <laughs> I mean, not for my living room, obviously, but for like a playroom or something, 30 bucks. I mean, you could put it in your living room. Why not? Oh boy, okay, again, I leave without a rug. How am I gonna carry it anyway, you know? Remember when Alex and I did a shop with me and we made a bet on whether or not our shoe cabinet would fit? And I won the bet. I love it, I love our shoe cabinet. Look at this though, uh, like a coat rack, but it looks like a cool new age type of teepee. That's pretty sweet. And then these little uh, clothes hangers are 10 bucks. What, $10? That's cool. Okay, I always skip through this section. What, what is here? Laundry stuff? I don't, ooh, luggage. Also that. Oh my gosh, look at this octopus hanger. Look at this too. This laundry basket, maybe? I don't, that looks like one. Okay, look at all of those. 20 bucks, what's new over here? It's like a cool little camping backpack or hiking. Okay, some organizational pieces like these. I like how that's compartmentalized. Oh, someone left their McDonald's cup. Uh-oh. I fell in love with this little section and then realized it's a big eyeball. A little eyeball? Big eyeball. What? I assume that's a rug. That is so cool. <laughs> like what? It's like half of a glasses. I don't even know. Like washi tape? That is so fun. Oh, look at this. Backpack and then a little pouch. Oh, they have more. Oh, this is cool stuff. Look at that big tote. Oh my goodness. How much is it? Two dollars? Oh my, where can I buy it? Kia is like decked out with this eyeball stuff. There's even a little stool there and a garbage can. I found the bags. So cool, I'm thinking beach tote, you know? Even pencils. This is getting ridiculous. I'm loving every second of it though. <laughs> Are you kidding? I don't even know what this is. Four dollars for, wait, a roll of tape? Oh my gosh, it's like a stationary set. Oh, wow, wow. This is really cool. Oh gosh, sorry, I'm breaking it. Darn it. All right, all right, I can fix it. Don't even worry about it. I got it. See that? Hey, what's on this one? Nothing, good. Nothing to break. Look at all of these new shelves right here. $13 for, the, like those are so cool. I really like the zigs, oh, I just like them all. Wow, those are cool. And hippie, and ooh, I really like that clock as well, wow. Wait, is that a clock? I'm an idiot. I think it's just a hook. Holy crap, Ikea, you're making me wanna redo my garage. Look at how that bicycle is stored. What a dream. Oh, we have so many bicycles. This little set of tools is $12. That's fantastic for someone, you know, going away, starting out. Look at this little workbench over here. Ooh, $83. Little steep for me, you know what I mean? But I do, wow, look at these shelves. Okay, how much are these shelves? Because they're amazing. Yes, they are amazing. Okay, at this point I've completely lost my cart slash but it's totally worth it. $15 for that. Is it 15 or just the cover? I'm confused. Okay, there's my purse. <laughs> I don't know, it's confusing. Shelf unit for $10, shelf unit for 15. So I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know if in the past I just completely overlooked all of this and it's always been here. Look at that cooler. Or if it's new, like look at this shelf too, $80. That shelf is huge. These are the bins I told you about before. They're $4. I really wish that my shelf accommodated the size. This is the size, by the way, 13 by 15 by 13. Do I need this notepad or do I want it? It's one in the same because it's a dollar. They have this notepad too. I'm unsure of the cost. I can't find uh, the name of it anywhere. Oh, wait. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Oh, look at this, what's in here? <gasps> what is this? Ooh, little hooks, but the box is so pretty. They have some pretty large totes here. This one is eight, that one is massive for 15. These are four over here. I don't know if you can really see how large they are. And this one is $2. 
Are the lids free? Because what? The lid is a dollar, in case you were wondering. You'll think it's worth it. Holy crap, this one is 50 cents. Yes. Entering the lights. Look how pretty this is. Do you see how gorgeous that is? $17 table lamp, beautiful. And this is precisely how I get overwhelmed and then end up with no lamp. <laughs> I think I might just pick up one of these because they're like 12 bucks. The colored ones are on sale for 10. Oh, wow. They take up like zero space. But even these, okay, see that lamp is $50, $60 which is the going rate for lamps. And this one over here is 27, which I feel like is a fantastic deal. It's just so pretty too. Okay, I'll get the cheap one. Okay, I don't know what that blue and white thing is. Is that a sheet? I want it. <laughs> All of these light fixtures are really pretty as well. Look at that flower one back there again. What are the odds? Also their batteries, oh my gosh, such a screaming deal. It's like a dollar or two. Ooh, maybe they upped their prices. Found these wall hangings. So this is around the time where I lose steam and just head out the, the Ikea doors. Uh, the artwork in here, so pretty and so reasonably priced. So it's $20 for a four pack, $20 for that, $20 for that. Ooh, okay, these are really pretty over here. <gasps> oh, really, really pretty. Oh, wow. And then look at this one, the ABC. Love that for like a playroom or something. It's on sale for 20 bucks. Ooh, these are really pretty too. Everything's pretty, obviously. I'm in love. Such pretty floral arrangements. Oh, those look pretty up on the shelf over there. Uh, but it's a dollar. You think it's for one rose or more? Nope, just one. It's not even a rose, it's a carnation, I think. Am I wrong? Don't tell me. They sell real plants here. If you didn't know, look at all of these succulents. Oh my God. It's $5, $3 for some of them. These, oh, and succulents grow and you barely have to water them. It's like my dream plant. Look how crazy this one looks. I don't want to touch it, but it looks amazing. Also these over here and what catches my eye. Oh my gosh, we have one of these. Seriously never dies, this one. We've had it since we moved in our house. These, I feel like very hard to kill as well. $8 for this huge, see this, this huge pot. So I'm down here, I shopped the clearance and I'm looking through the seasonal, nothing too impressive yet. And I found, well, first of all, I found some chocolate over there, definitely picked it up. And, and then I found these loofahs, a three pack for $2. What? And then $4.49 for a pack of hangers. Some really cute seasonal items over here. We saw some of these prints earlier, but like those baby jars and those cups over there. Also, I was looking for these dishes earlier and what is this, a six pack for $3.79. Pretty cool. Also more cups and bowls, $3.79 for each set. Look at this little basket up here, 20 bucks. Ooh, mixing bowls slash serving bowls. I don't see any more of these, but they have lids with them. Okay, how much are you? These planters are really cute too, $5. There's a two pack for $3, one right inside of the other. Are those napkins? Oh my goodness. Is this a placement? They're so cute. Okay, and the cups are a six pack for $8. Will you take a peek at these lights? I am freaking out. These are like beach balls and bees. Oh my gosh, I love them. And then these light lanterns and lights. More lights, ladybugs. So cute. Oh no, I wanted to go food shopping. Ikea food is the coolest. I grabbed a few things like the Swedish meatballs. Uh, but it looks like everything else is a bust. Ooh, they still have one working. All right, well, I grabbed my Swedish meatballs already at the checkout and my lingonberry and, well, you know what? I'm gonna do a haul. So, you just have to wait and find out, I guess. It is like a million degrees out. I'm finally out of Ikea. It's been hours. You can never go in that store just for like a minute. You know what I mean? Um, anyway, thank you guys so much for shopping with me. I hope you enjoyed your time shopping around Ikea. I always enjoy, look at that bag in the back. It looks so pretty. I always enjoy my time with you. If you want to, subscribe, put a little more happy in your day, and I will see you next time. Bye. With a haul.
I think I'm gonna do a haul. I think I got enough stuff. Yeah, why not? You wanna see one?